So here in part two, I'm going to show you how to make a deluxe grilled cheese sandwich that's got raspberry preserves, pecans, onions, and cheese in it. So what you're going to need for this sandwich are seedless raspberry preserves, like you see right there, sourdough bread, butter or butter substitute, olive oil. Uh, you can use Swiss cheese or you can use Munster cheese. Uh, chopped pecans and chopped green onions. This is real simple to make, takes about three minutes, so let's get started. So first you spread one of your sourdough slices with the uh, raspberry preserves, the seedless raspberry preserves. Then you top that with the green onions. like so. And then you uh, add the chopped pecans on top of that, like this. So it looks like that. And then you add the cheese. I had mentioned that you might need butter. Uh, you really don't need butter if you're going to use olive oil. Uh, in your frying pan. I prefer to use olive oil, but you can use butter or a butter substitute. So you heat some uh, olive oil in your frying pan until it gets hot. Then you take your assembled sandwich and put that into the pan and let it toast up. Now at home on a regular stove it might take two to three minutes for each side to get golden brown, but out here on this propane stove I got to watch. It might take a little bit longer. But you toast each side till it's golden brown, and then cut it in half, and pair it with the, uh, with the homemade tomato soup that I showed you how to make in the other video, and uh, you have a great lunch. Okay, I just flipped my sandwich. That's the golden brown you're going for on both sides. Uh, took a little bit longer than two to three minutes out here on a propane stove, just because it's hard to adjust the heat on a propane stove. But, uh, and I probably could have done this top side maybe another minute. But, yeah, that's what you want to get, a golden brown color. Look how that cheese is starting to melt. Yeah, this is a really great sandwich. I think you'll like it. So here's the finished product. You got the uh, grilled cheese here. Look at that. Doesn't look delicious. And then the homemade tomato soup here. And some iced tea and you got yourself the perfect lunch out here in the middle of nowhere where it's super hot, super desolate, and super nice. And that would be Death Valley.